mistress mine, where are you? Oh, mistress mine, where are you? Oh, stay and hear your true love's calling. Couplets. Couplets. Two successive lines of verse, usually. Having some unity greater than mere contiguity. A pair. A couple. Two items of the same kind occurring together. A window with two lights. A musical episode alternating with the main theme. Hello, I'm Victoria Wyndham. And I play Rachel Corey Hutchins on Another World. I'm Charles Keating. I play her husband, Carl. We'd like to introduce you to our CD. Cups. You, who love lovers, this is your home. Welcome. Two little who's. He and she. Under are this wonderful, wonderful tree smiling stand. Or realms of where and when beyond. Now and here. Far from a grown-up I and you. Full world of known. Who and who. Two, Two little ands. And, and over them this. A flame with, with dreams. dreams. Incredible is. I found a flower. I found a flower. My flower is big and beautiful and extremely robust. That's true. Your flower is dark and ungainly and probably will not last until morning. It will certainly be a struggle. I love my flower for its richness and its grandeur. I love my flower for its spiritual values. What spiritual values? My flower is a tragic flower. It has soul, it has poetry. Just because my flower's bigger, it can't have poetry? My flower must struggle for hourly survival. It is taken with the basics. It broods over deep things. Are you calling my flower a dilettante? Your flower is rich and probably has a leisure problem. I suddenly feel like beating your head flower over the head with my flower. My flower would die. Lovingly. I apologize. I have a vulgar flower. My flower truly understands. Oh, mistress mine, where are you? Oh, mistress mine, where are you roaming? First, we're going to explain why they're screaming about Another World in the background. For years now, loyal viewers of NBC's Another World have been entranced by the trials and tribulations of Rachel Corey and Carl Hutchins. The two are prone to spontaneous outbursts of public poetry reading and other amorous pursuits. And now... What do you mean, public poetry? <laughs> we saw you on that bench in Washington Square Park. <laughs> Story. <laughs> Charles Keating and Victoria Wyndham join us to tell us about your newest endeavor, a CD called yes. Couplets. Yes, What's indeed. it all about? Mostly, mostly poetry, love poetry. It's and it was all generated by our fans, our wonderful yeah. fans back here. Yeah. Several thousand of whom are joining us here today. So we can hear you two reading poetry yes. to each other. Can you give us a little sampling here this morning? Do you want the uh, the dirty bits or the clean bits? <laughs> it's, it's network television yes, it's morning. Let's go with the two, clean two little who's. <laughs> he and she. Under artists. Wonderful tree. Smiling stands. All realms of where and when beyond. Now and here. Far from a grown-up eye and you, full world of known. Who and who. Two, two little, little arms. And over, over them this. A flame, flame with dreams. dreams. Incredible, incredible is. is. From Carl to Rachel. Oh. And you can hear more of the same, plus some naughty bits, I guess, on the new CD called Couplets. That's wonderful. Put out by Shanaki Records. They've yes. taken a chance. And available in all of your local uh, record stores. <laughs> Tower and Borders and uh, all, all of them. So go out and buy it for Valentine's Day, because yeah. it's a great yeah. Valentine's Day. Yeah. It's like a yeah. wonderful yeah. Pleasure. Thank you, guys. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Happy Valentine's Day.